Well, season three of Chucky finds the infamous killer doll within the walls of the White House. Meanwhile, Tiffany Valentine is behind bars due to Jennifer Tilly's murderous rampage, and she's not happy about it. Take a look. My execution is tonight. I should have been out of here weeks ago. Wow. All the guards are on board now, except for... Except the sniper out front. For some reason, you have failed to bring me even a single hair from his head. Or a glove. Or a shoe. Well, he was out sick for a week. And, you know, snipers do tend to be loners. Your excuses aren't going to save me from lethal injection! Oh, my goodness, and Jennifer Tilly is with us now. Welcome back. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yeah, she's understandably upset. She Tiffany is. Has gone through her whole life killing people without compunction, <laughs> and then she made the mistake of killing somebody in the state of Texas, and they don't take too kindly to us murdering their citizens. So <laughs> now she's headed towards a lethal injection chamber. She is. There's, all, there's you know, always so much drama with Jennifer Tiffany and it's well it's really complicated <laughs> it Tiffany is. Tiffany the doll was Jennifer Tilly's biggest fan she became fixated on her because Jennifer Tilly played Tiffany in the movie version of right. Chucky and Tiffany yes. and so she was stalking her and then through voodoo she entered Jennifer Tilly's body so the last 20 years she's been living the fabulous glamorous movie star life yes. of Jennifer Tilly kind of ruining my career and Jennifer Tilly the person got trapped in the doll so are y'all keeping up at home? Say, it's very thank complicated. Thank you for breaking that down for everybody yes. better you than mm -hmm. me. But, Ch but this season, Chucky is dying. Yes. He has aged. What do you make of his new look? Well, Chucky is dying of old age, but it's an accelerated voodoo old age. Yes. And he looks really disgusting. He has like oozing yes, sores and pus, and he's a crypt keeper. <laughs> he looks like the crypt keeper. He um, does. Tiffany has not seen the new incarnation of Chucky. You see, she has a phone conversation with him, but I think she actually actually saw what he looked like, she would be like, ew, ew. <laughs> honey, you need to take care of those sores. <laughs> yeah, that's how she would handle it. Yes. And this season goes big, too, because Chucky is trying to take over the White House. Yes. I know that uh, creator um, Don, Mancini. Don Mancini has already pitched uh, season four. He has, yes. Do you have any say in kind of where your character goes? I do not, but I do know, you know, my character cuts off Nika's arms and legs, you know, but in a nice way, because she didn't want Nika to run away because she loved him. Sort in of a like, nice way. Way. Yeah, sort of how you, how you spay uh, an animal or you cut the wings off of a bird so it won't fly away. Right. So I don't understand why Nika is so angry at me. And then Don said, Jennifer, I came up with a really good idea how, you know, the fans, you know how they're mad at you, how you will get more sympathy. And I said, what? He goes, Nika shoots you in the leg and then has to be amputated. And then you have a really cool wooden leg that you found in an <laughs> antique store. And I was like... No. And he goes, no, it'd be so great. I go, I do not want to spend the next 20 years yeah. wearing knee-high boots and walking with the limb. Right. He's like, oh, like, okay, I guess I'll think of something else. Yeah. And I'm so sure I do have a little bit of say. Yes, and I sure, I'm sure what he comes up with will be just as juicy as I'm the sure. I, the yeah, he has the most fertile imagination. I think that's why the show has lasted. Well, I, I say 27 years because that's when I came on, but yeah. I think it's been 30 years ago that the first oh Chucky, we've done seven movies and three seasons of the oh television god. show. Oh my god. And can we talk about Chucky's Instagram page for a second because whoever's mm. doing that, it's genius. They are so creative. They're so creative. Mm. How do you know there's obviously there's Taylor Swift's album, Beyonce's album, yes. the solar clips. That is mm. Tiffany as um, uh, Taylor Swift's album. Yes. What do, you, what do you make of her cover? I did not know that because I was looking at that picture and I'm like, Tiffany looks really weird. I <laughs> didn't know the Beyonce reference, but um, yeah, they really are plugged into popular culture. Yeah. And that is great for our show because we spoof popular culture. Yeah. And you know, we don't take ourselves too seriously. Yes, there's a little plastic doll running around killing people, but we're all having a good time doing it. Yes, and, and you're having a good time 25, 25 years, 25th anniversary of Family Guy. My gosh. Yes. Apparently, there's a movie that's going to happen with that, too, and he already knows, Seth yes. MacFarlane, what it's going to be about. Do mm -hmm. you know what it's well, going to be Well, I'm not as close with Seth MacFarlane as I am Don Mancini. You know, I can always apply Don Mancini with a little alcohol and get some information <laughs> out of him. But Seth isn't so yeah, easy. Yeah, he's a little more mysterious. Uh, well, when you find out, you come back and you let us know. And you will. can catch Chucky Wednesdays at 9 p.m. on USA and Sci-Fi. 10 p.m. 10 p.m. 10 p.m. And streaming the next day on Peacock in case you missed the 10 p.m. Jennifer, uh -huh. thanks so much. Good to see oh, you. Oh, it's good to see you.